If you'll all take your seats, we can get started. If you'll all be so kind as to ante up. And now for another bounty challenge. Well, this is embarrassing. You've completed a slate of our most grueling bounty challenges. But we appear to have run out of bounty items. The tournament is being controlled by aliens. Pay no attention to that. Ah, a rare GLaDOS personality core. A fitting bounty indeed. No, it's really not. Trust no one. Whoever wins the tournament will take the core as a prize. To claim the bounty, all you have to do is win the tournament. Sure, why not? Think, think, think. I'll read that. Nah. Oh, Sam. Think of all the ham dingers we could buy with that. <sighs> Shh, I'm thinking. I call. Uh, hole this bloody should have punji sticks at the bottom. Check. I'll bet. Call. I'll check. That's a check. Check. Check, please. The little robot has a pair of fours. Sam has a pair of fours. Claptrap wins with a queen kicker. That's what you get when you screw with the clown! There was probably a better way to phrase that. If you're enjoying tonight's little slice of Aperture Science, I can arrange a complimentary tour of my facility after the tournament. Yeah, I'll get right on that. Sorry, Max and I don't do factory tours ever since the Hamdinger's incident. Count me in, honey bear! Hooray, another malfunctioning robot. Check. Oh, man. Well. Raise. Folding? But you could have lost so much money. Not this time. Claptrap steals the pot. Again? You shouldn't have. Yeah, I'll call. I call. Hmm. They can't win if you don't play. Ed. Call. Call. I think I'll call. Have any of you considered the career opportunities as an Aperture Science test subject? Don't most of your test subjects end up falling down bottomless pits? That was the old Aperture. Today I can state with confidence that over 95% of our previously bottomless pits have been outfitted with state-of-the-art stain-resistant floor panels. What Sam is trying to say is that Aperture's test subjects have a nasty habit of dying. Everyone dies eventually. You're dying right now, even as you sit here, struggling to intuit the simplest combinator calculations, cell by cell, heartbeat by heartbeat. Yeah, so? 
So why not make the most of your mortality by contributing to science? I think I'll just write a check. That's a, uh, that's a pretty healthy pile. This hand just overloaded my bluff buffer. Check. Way to go out on a limb there, Captain Courageous. Mr. Williams has a pair of tens. The player has two pair. The player wins the hand. I'll call. Uh. Old. Call! This is gonna get ugly, isn't it? I call. Check? Check. Checko. LOL cats are being used by the Illuminati to communicate via steganography. This call is well within my accepted parameters for kicking your butt! Call. I call. That's a check. I'll check that. Checkorama. Spicy. I call. I call. Call. Check. Huh. All right. Who wants some? Great day in the morning. Don't be scared by the chips. Don't be scared by the chips. I'm fooled. Well, that was a clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. Nah! The player has two pair. And Mr. Williams has two pair. Ash wins with the higher pairs. It's good to be the king. You might want to pace yourself there. So, Sam, why don't you take off your jacket? Two reasons. First of all, I paid a team of highly skilled artisans a metric butt-ton of money for this new suit. So I'm gonna show it off like a trophy wife at a back-to-school night. And the second reason? <laughs> Underneath this jacket, I'm sweating like a fat guy in a walk-in humidor. Ugh, thanks for sharing that. All in. Really? Good for you. I'll fold. Oof, I think I just got kicked in the statisticals. <laughs> Looks like I've gone belly up, and so is my hand. The player has three of a kind. Sam has two pair. The player wins. What's this emotion I'm feeling? It's like I wish I had those cards, but I also hate you for having them. That's envy, you emotionally stunted rhomboids. And now I'm learning arousal. Nice hand. Almost as nice as this one. Sam has been eliminated. Hmm. Maybe next time I should read up on poker strategies instead of reading funny lists on the internet. Hey Sam, check it out! Six pivotal moments in history that depended on lunch meats! Curse you, Max. The blinds are now 600 and 1200. I'll call that. 
Nope. I see. Back. Okay. At least one of us is full of crap. And I know it isn't me, because I don't have any bowels. I... phrase. Nice. Mistake, Junior. Well, I probably wouldn't have done that, but I'm not you. Booyah! <laughs> Booyah! Claptrap has two pair, and our silent friend has ace high. Well, you got more guts than brains there, mister. Claptrap wins the pot. It was secretly a ruse all along! I do know what I'm doing! <laughs> hey, GLaDOS. Something I've always wondered about happened you. Whatever happened to Cave Johnson? Cave Johnson. That name doesn't appear in my databanks. Ash grabs the pot. Anyhow. Oh, come on, Cave Johnson, the founder of Aperture Science. Musty tells me he used to hang out with the original Team Venture all the time before he disappeared in the 80s. I'm all fucking in. Who the what now? Call. I call. <laughs> Jack? Bet. Fold. Oh. <sighs> Didn't even get to the river. Cool. Brock has ace high, and Ash has two pair. Ash wins. Someone get a hose, cause I'm on fire, baby. Brock Samson has been eliminated. Brock. Brock, do you require assistance? I'm... fine. Did you smell that? I've got a bad feeling about this. I'll bet. Yeah, I'll bet. I'm trying to figure out what you're thinking and it's making my brain hurt. Ah, jeez. Ah, jeez. Ashley has a pair of queens. The player has a pair of queens. The player wins with the eight kicker. Buckle up. It's gonna be a bumpy hand. Ecce, oozers lay. I'll 
check that. Check. I'm gonna check. Come on, Ash, it's only money. Yeah, I'll bet. Okay, Claptrap, keep it cool. Don't stare at the money, or it'll think you're a creep. You know what? It's time to raise a mother loving roof on this pot. Whoop, whoop. All in. <laughs> Looks like you backed poor old Claptrap into a corner. Call. Looks like old Clappy's just bought himself a big old sack of pain. Yeah. Mr. Trap has three of a kind, and Mr. Williams has a flush. Mr. Williams wins the pot. Come to daddy. The robot from Pandora is out of chips. I'm out? Really? I was just getting started! Trust me, you weren't. It's time to raise the blinds to 800 and 1600. You ready to try and take down the king, kid? Do you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking that I should put the two of you in a cryogenic unit so that I can replay this tournament over and over at my leisure. Mr. Williams takes the blinds. Another pot for me? You shouldn't have. Anyway, do you know what I'm thinking? I'm thinking that I should put the two of you in a cryogenic unit so that I can replay this tournament over and over at my leisure. But that would be wrong. I'll bet. I'll check. Ash has a pair of aces, and you have two pair. The player wins the hand. Mr. Williams takes the blinds. Wild Deadites couldn't keep me out of this party. Clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. Okay, I'll bet. Okay then. Ashley has two pair, and the player has two pair. The player wins with an ace kicker. I'll check that. Check. 
Every claptrap unit has a small gray cube deep within its machinery. The purpose of these cubes is unknown. Yeah, I'm in. Hmm. Hmm. I wonder if I can sucker you into betting this much. Trying to read my face for tells, huh? Well, good luck with that. I've taken so many blows to the head that the muscles in my face twitch for no damn reason at all. See? I call. Mr. Williams has ace high, and you have a flush. The player wins. That's a relief. I was worried you might screw that up again. I've taken the liberty of moving the blinds to 1,000 and 2,000. This tournament is giving me an overwhelming sense of deja vu. Now I remember. It's just like that time my bad rats fought over a piece of cheese. The funny thing is the rats didn't really need to eat the cheese. They were just conditioned to want the cheese by weeks of electrical stimulation. In the end they killed each other, and the cheese was eaten by one of the human test subjects. We died too, because the cheese was moldy. Wow. <laughs> ben. Okay then. Ash has a pair of fives. The player has a pair of fives. The player wins with a queen kicker. Okay then. Ah, I'm in. Chuck Finley do. All right. All in. Ash grabs the pot. All righty. Ash Williams is unaware that his great-grandfather was a member of the Illuminati. Yeah, I'll call. Pot. The Ash and Wendy Williams Honeymoon Fund thanks you for your continued support. Mr. Williams takes the blinds. Have we met? That's extremely unlikely. You and the player travel in different circles. Different circles? Ooh, well, laddie, freaking da. Hold on. All right, all in. Well, that was a clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. Yeah. <laughs> ha! Mr. Williams has a full house, and the player has three of a kind. Ash wins the hand. All right, super groovy. 
Did you know that the term blinds was coined by a blind poker player in the 19th century? Of course you didn't, because it's a lie. In any event, I'm upping the blinds to 1200 and 2400. Mr. Williams takes the blinds. Today the pizza boy came to my door, but I hadn't ordered any pizza, so now I have to move. Yeah, I'm in. I'll check. Hold on. Yeah, I'll bet. Most people are bound by the conventions of probability and common sense. But you're special. Nah. The player takes the pot. Check. I'll keep this friendly. Ash grabs the pot. Boom. Call. <laughs> Bet. Bet. All in, baby. Well, that was a clever move that won't come back to bite you in your ample posterior. Ashley has a pair of threes, and our silent friend has two pair. The player wins the hand. Oh no, it's the Puppet Master. I know too much. Congratulations. You won. I hope you weren't expecting baked desserts, because I don't do that anymore. Take me now before she uses her mind bullets. <laughs>